Osteoporosis is a disease that makes your bones weak. People with osteoporosis can break their bones easily. Breaking a bone can be serious, especially if you break your hip after falling at home. What are the warning signs of osteoporosis? Osteoporosis usually develops slowly. The first sign is often a bone fracture after bumping into something or having a minor fall. In people with osteoporosis, these bones may break even without a fall or injury. Another common sign is back pain that does not go away. This pain can be from a small fracture in the bones of the back. How do you know that you have osteoporosis? Osteoporosis does not cause symptoms until you break a bone. Your doctor can test you for osteoporosis using a bone density test called the DEXA scan, which is a special kind of x-ray. Experts recommend testing bone density for women above 65, men above 70, and younger people with fractures and those with risk factors. Some people learn that they have osteoporosis because they break a bone during a fall or a mild impact. This is called a fragility fracture because people with healthy bones should not break a bone that easily. People with fragility fracture are at high risk of having other bones break. Risk factors for osteoporosis include advancing age, postmenopausal women, previous fracture, current cigarette smoking, drinking large amounts of alcohol, eating a low calcium diet, being inactive or underweight, taking steroid medicines, having a small body frame or low body weight, having a relative with hip fracture, having rheumatoid arthritis, as well as secondary causes of osteoporosis. Secondary causes of osteoporosis include premature menopause, malabsorption, malnutrition, celiac disease and chronic liver disease, inflammatory bowel diseases such as Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. Hormonal abnormalities may also cause osteoporosis such as hyperparathyroidism, hyperthyroidism, hypogonadism, and growth hormone deficiency. Having low vitamin D, low calcium, and low phosphate may also cause osteoporosis. Some cancers, including multiple myeloma, can cause osteoporosis. Diabetes mellitus is also associated with osteoporosis. Osteogenesis imperfecta and certain drugs are also associated with osteoporosis. What can you do to keep your bones healthy? You can eat foods with a lot of calcium and green leafy vegetables such as kale and broccoli. You can also eat foods with a lot of vitamin D and fish from the ocean like salmon. Take calcium and vitamin D if you do not get enough from the food that you eat. Be active for at least 30 minutes most days of the week. You can use free weights or resistance bands or balance exercises and walking. Avoid smoking and limit the amount of alcohol you drink to 1-2 to two drinks a day at most. Do your best to keep from falling. Watch previous video on fall prevention for more information. Keep adequate lighting, remove throw rugs, use comfort height toilet seat, have grab bar available, and use a shower chair if needed. See your eye doctor regularly and use sensible shoes. Discuss your medicines with your doctor as some medicines are associated with osteoporosis. How is osteoporosis treated? Your doctor may suggest different medicines to slow down bone loss and reduce the risk of broken bones. People with the highest risk of breaking a bone are the ones most likely to benefit from medication. Postmenopausal women and men 50 years of age or older with a history of hip or vertebral spine fracture or with osteoporosis on bone density testing should be treated for osteoporosis. There are different kinds of medicines available for osteoporosis including oral tablets, injections, and IV infusion. Speak with your doctor with regards to which medication is best suited for you. Remember to ask your doctor about possible side effects of these medications and its cost. Thank you for listening. If you like this video, please click the like button, hit subscribe, and ring the bell. Be healthier!